equals that. Okay. So now we have both of the functions and what I want to do is combine these two. The reason being is because it will be nice to work with. Combine the two data frames. Okay, so let's just make sure everything's working. DFD and print comma DFF. Okay, let's run this. Make sure both of the data frames are out here. What's up with this though? Why is that? SMA 20. SMA tw hmm. I think I should not print them here. Let's run that back. Just make sure everything is set up correctly. weird thing happened here the SMA 20 jumped over here and I don't know why hmm is it my screen maybe is it shifted over interesting I think it's just an error with the uh, the shifting on the output but oh it's because I did this stupid comma thing yeah that's why okay let's try this again all right now let's run it let's see if this looks nice okay perfect so Timestamp. I wonder why this timestamp has a minute. Oh, it's because it's the 15 minute. That's why it's wider. Okay, got it, got it, got it. I actually don't want to combine those. I forgot you don't want to combine those because one's on the 15 minute interval and one's on the daily. I'm sure you already caught that, to be honest. But, you know, I'm making a video as well, so <laughs> I'm kind of multitasking. Um, let's see here. Next thing we want to do. Let's look at the strategy. We're determining 